Good morning, everyone. How's everyone doing on this Sunday morning? Cloudy as it may be, but my spirits are not cloudy. I was getting up, and I've been up early this morning, very early this morning. And I was about to take the trash out, but then I said, no. I said, uh, it's got to be still wet. I'll wait and see if it's going to dry out a little bit. So in the meantime and in between time, I hope, let's see, I'm trying to figure out how the lighting is in here. Because I'm trying to show the covers. I think I showed you. I don't know if this is the one. I think I showed you that. And uh, one of the, um, in the comments, someone asked me to show some of my crochet. And so that's what I'm doing, y'all. I'm trying to appease someone. This right here seems like I'm not getting it right. This is like scrap, a lot of pieces of scrap yarn I had. But I vow to myself never to make this again. This, to me, I found to be very difficult, even though I love it. I love it. It could be used as a, you know, a throw afghan or, you know, like a baby blanket or something like that. You could put it under, a, you know, across your lap or something. And this one, I'm not going to open it up. I like the stitch. I forgot what it's called. But I think I got it from, oh my goodness. I forgot the name. You know, it's been a while now since I've uh, did any crochet. But anyway, this is it. I'm not fond of the colors. But this is just some yarn I had, and I took it apart. And uh, did it over. See, this is two different colors of yellow in here. Like I say, these camera, this camera is not doing it any good. Matter of fact, it's on my phone, so you know... <laughs> I need a camera to bring out the true colors. And here is the other one, because I had two of these. I made two of these same, but see, this one is smaller. This is like a baby blanket size. It's not as big as the other one. But the colors are the same. See, the colors are the same, this pink, and it's like an olive green. And I still got a marker in here. Oh, wow. After all this time. Let me see. That's a little marker. You know, if you got to remember something when you're crocheting. That's not all, y'all. There's a whole lot more than this. But I'm not going to show you all of them today. I will show you some today. Some another day. Some of this stuff. I have forgotten myself. This is a, I guess it's a afghan or something that, let me get close. See, this is a different stitch. They, they are like different stitches. This is like a baby blue and a baby yellow, I guess. I love the color of this and I like this stitch. But believe it or not, <laughs> a lot of these stitches, I would have to go back. Let me take these glasses off. I would have to go back and review because you will forget these stitches if you don't, you know, stick to it. You'll forget the stitches and you have to go. But once you go back, review a little bit, you know, because uh, a lot of these stitches I, I got from um, people on the YouTube, you know, the crochet, YouTube could crochet. And they are really, like, I mean, they put out some beautiful work, y'all. I have to admit, I learned a lot from YouTube. But I'm self-taught, really. I'm self-taught uh, how to crochet and how to sew. You know, because like I said, I sew a lot for my children. And I'm out of breath, y'all. This one. I... Uh, 
And you see that it's like a quilt. It's almost like a quilt. This is not really an easy pattern to follow either. Oh. But it's easy if you get it right the first time, then it's easy. You know, like if you, you, you do a practice swap first, and then, you know, you can do it. You can do it right. But as you can see, my blocks are not correct. But you don't know that because you're not a crocheter. But I know it. See, the blocks are not quite. I don't know where the error is myself right now, y'all, but I remember this being an error. As a matter of fact, when I'm going through this right now, I'm looking at it just like y'all because uh, it's been a while. I, I forgot what I crochet. This is honest and goodness true. So some of this stuff is a surprise to me as well. <sighs> Here we go. I don't know. Maybe I should hold the camera. I don't know what I should do or how I should present this because it's really, let's see if I turn it this way. I'm trying to get it so you can see the colors. But there's so many colors uh, in here. That's the best I can do with the presentation, y'all. One of these days, I'll get me a new camera when I can afford it. And I put a little edging around the edge. These are different colors. And I got it half folded now. Maybe you could see better. It's all different colors in here. And believe me, this stuff gets heavy. It's a bigger. That's why you don't, you, you really don't make these big, you know, real big because they are so heavy. Let's see if you can see that better if it's folded. Colors still not showing up well. Not, you know, vibrant like they are. They're very vibrant colors. And here's another one which is the same thing. This is the same, well, not the same thing. It's the same pattern as this one, but it's the same color as the one I showed you before. Basically. And it's going this way. This is how you start. If you were going to crochet this, you would start right here. If you were going to crochet this, you would start, this is the beginning, and then you go, you keep going like that. Very easy. This is a very easy, I remember getting this from, uh, this stitch from Jada in Stitches. In fact, this cover here is the same as this. These two patterns are the same. But they're just different colors, and it depends on if you uh, depends on how you do it, and it makes it look different. But they're really not different; they're basically the same. And you learn a lot of that when you're in crochet and when you're doing crochet, <coughs> how to mix colors and and stuff like that, and you mix the patterns and stuff. And I think it does it for this batch. And I'm worn out, y'all, just from this. Let's see, how many is that, two? I've got two of these. Well, two, this one, like I said, is way, let's see. This one is way bigger than the other one. You could wear this, I mean, you could use this, like, on maybe across your bed. I'll show you one that I have on my bed. I don't think I sewed all the ends on it, but see these two 
One is smaller, and this one is larger. But they're the same color. Hold on, y'all. Be right back. This is what I usually have at the end of my bed. See how big it is? I can put this, you know, if I get cold at night, I have it folded like this. And then if I get cold at night, I grab this bad boy. See how big, it's big and it's heavy. But they're very vibrant colors. Woo, I gotta sit down after that, y'all. That thing is heavy. and. I'll show you some more the next time. But right now, it's time for a break. I hope I'm recording. Oh. Boy, that wore me out. Let me see if we can see this better. Let me see. Ugh. See the vibrant colors? That's what making afghans and crocheting is all about colors that you want. You can't find all these colors in a store. And, and, and crocheting can be expensive. It's a sort of expensive habit. And so, you know, like if you want, for people that sell them, you know, they're expert. They're, you know, much better than mine. But um, it, it costs a pretty penny, really. I remember my mother made a whole bed spray. And uh, let me turn this off. Look at the fish. I'm, I'm watching fish today, y'all. I'm watching the aquarium today. No birds today. And uh, my mother made a whole bed spray to fit the whole bed, you know, the hangover and everything. But I never made one that big. I think this this one here... Is about, no, I did make one, but I gave it to my grandson. I've given all my grandchildren covers. Some got two, some got three. <sighs> and now I got all these. This is not all of them. This, like I said, I have to show you some more at another time. I've got a whole bunch of them because I love it. I love the crochet. But then when my uh, neck started hurting, I stopped. But I don't think it was from crochet. I actually think it's from this computer. Because I wasn't my computer that I used to use before this. A little computer, you know. Then I got this big one. You know, my daughter got it for Christmas, I think, a couple of years ago. And my, my neck has been bothering me ever since. Ever since I got that, uh, that computer. You know, something like corporate carpal tunnel but it's in your ne in my neck because I would have to look up you know like when I'm playing games or something seem like I'm looking up whereas before I was just looking straight ahead and it still bothers me certain way I turn my neck that pain is ooh, it's horrible and at one time I was suffering I had the car carpal tunnel I think that's what I'm pronouncing it right I had that, you know, it was hurting me, you know, and the doctor told me this is what it's from. She, she said it's from the computer, but it doesn't bother me anymore. As a matter of fact, she had given me a, a brace to wear. You know, you put it like, I'll say from your wrist up, and then it fits somehow or another in your finger, around your finger. You've probably seen those things. It's something like a cast almost, but you can take it on and off. As a matter of fact, I think I left it when I moved. I should have brought it with me. But anyway, y'all, I got work to do, but I don't have to cook. Thank you very much. No cooking for me today. Dinner is ready. I'm having chicken. Everything is ready. I got more chicken salad. I'm having, uh, if I have the chicken, I don't know if I'm having any baked chicken. And I got baked chicken in the freezer. I made my collard greens I got from the country store. I mean, not the country store, the farmer's market. And, uh, what else? Hmm. Huh. 
That's, that's it. Unless I decide to make a little dab of tape. So, uh, now I don't feel like I want to get up. I'm stiff. Stiff as a board, y'all. I got to fold these covers, put these back, and on my next video, I might make y'all another. I might do show you some more of those covers that I made. This is the way my, uh, see my, my little, uh, tripod can stretch up. See, but I was afraid that you wouldn't be able to see it. And I'm, I'm going to see how this video, I hope it comes out okay. If it doesn't, then I'm not going to publish it. But this is the video of the day. Have a great day, everyone.